Hi guys, so we're in chapter 1.2 in this one's quest and we're going up against Spider Gwen. So this time around, I'll be trying Hyperion, okay? And see what happens. Remember, she has an arc overload, so she basically regens, and every time she throws her heavy attack, she would go unstoppable. If you guys haven't noticed, it end it lagged there at the end. Hyperion is is a is a viable option because uh, his incinerate would um, mitigate the regeneration. And whenever you get cornered, whenever you get cornered, you know, whenever you are in the corner, I mean, his power gain will help you. Oh well, we uh, managed to squeak in that victory. So a lesson here is that, I mean a word to the wise is that, you know, even if you're unstoppable, even if you're unstoppable and she throws a heavy attack, her heavy attack will land and then the unstoppable, you know, will be to no avail, okay?
So Spider Gwen is not that hard. You just have to worry about her arc overload slash regeneration. And then again, every time she throws that heavy attack, she will go unstoppable, okay? Hyperion is pretty awesome, okay? And then Killmonger is alright, and then of course, sometimes, uh, and of course, Venom. Now for 100% completion, Chapter 1, we get 3,000 of these tier 4 basic goddess fragments. One premium crystal. 500 4 star shards. 250 500 4 star shards. 250 5 star shards. 8 stacks of these. Tier 4 class catalyst fragment crystal. 10 units. 250k. 253 star shards. And the usual stuff. Some gold. A quest crystal and some ISO. I do. I appreciate you guys. <clears throat> I appreciate you guys watching my videos. And thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and supporting my channel. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. And leave a like if you would. Leave a like if you uh, enjoyed this video or found this video helpful. Please like and subscribe guys, take care and like and subscribe, take care.